hello hello internet um yes so we finally bought a vlogging camera and gonna do some vlogging for you guys uh today we are just we've been running around all day um but we're going camping tomorrow so we've got all our gear everywhere um but what we've done is we've bought a roof rack Okay, sorry about that. A bit of an amateur hour. Um, yeah, so this camera actually has manual settings as far as everything goes for video. Um, so it's my fat finger. Can't really touch that screen to set it sometimes. So that's why the delay. Yes, we finally got it. Anyway, so as you can see, that is a car we're taking to camping tomorrow. And we bought a roof rack just because we got five of us camping and uh, a whole lot of gear I guess we're gonna bring so the idea is to put that thing up on here Alright guys, um, so we just finished setting up our portable setup, you can see right there, and we're going to hook this baby up. Alright guys, um, yes, I finally finished setting up, I'm at Tetra Receptions up in the Mount Dandenongs, uh, very very cool place as you can see, very pretty, it's old school, there's a little fountain, water fountain right there feature. Um, yeah, well, still not getting used to... Well, I've got this little camera that has a screen, but then i got to look into the lens, hey. Um, but yes, it's been a heck of a day. Um, first of all, we ran around uh, trying to get stuff done. Oh, hey, we actually managed to get the roof rack on. Have a look, have a look. There we go. Have a look. Can you see? Can you see? There it is. The roof rack's on. Uh, and we're ready for this camping trip tomorrow. In the meantime, we're at this photo booth gig uh, that will last for a couple of hours. So we're just gonna chill, do, this, do some edits. Um, I think that's about it. Do you more in uh, when I pack up and on, on the way home, I guess. But um, yeah, it's been a good day so far. Uh, I've been driving a lot, a lot to get that rack. We have to drive like about an hour and a half away from my house to get it. And then I have to drive into the city which is another hour and 45 minutes away. So there's a lot of driving and where I am now is another hour away uh, from any civilized station. Um, but yes, it's good, it's good. Uh, I'm looking forward to vlogging with you guys, vlogging with you guys or talking to you guys. And um, yeah, subscribe, I guess. Cheese. Um, it's ridiculously dark outside, we haven't started driving yet. Um, but yes, we'll check in with you. I'll check in with you guys when I get home. Oh, focus, come on. Uh, struggle, struggle. Alright guys, um, <coughs> as you can see, we're running into a bit of a problem, I think we're running out of petrol, uh, I don't know if you can see me or not, but um, yes, so, really hoping to find a petrol station real soon.
sort of feed you all in about 20 seconds. But yes, like I said, oh, by the way, this is Deakin University. Check it out. Inside the roof rack, um, that's uh, two folding chairs. That's it. Um, yes. I was hoping they would have. Now, the reason why I take I got to United most of the times because they have a. They have um, what you call. 95 E10, which is basically 10% ethanol or sugar cane juice or something like that. Um, basically, it gives older cars, well, I am to believe that it gives older car like mine a little bit more power, makes it go a little bit further. Um, and the super power and the well, it is still better than only getting 91 at the moment which sucks um, yeah cuz United usually have E10 it's usually green if you can look at the sign um, it's if I'm not mistaken this morning it was a dollar 19 instead of a dollar 21 so yeah guys um so we find we finally made it home it's a mess there's gears everywhere talking about everywhere look at all those gears um so yes so we're finally back and I guess this is the end of the day um, so first vlog let's see how we go I just thought I'll share my life with you guys just because uh, there's a few reasons I won't tell you now but yes uh, remember to stay safe work hard dream hard cheers